He is definitely Cheeks Premier. <laughs> Freak's Premier player. Cheeks Absolutely. Is definitely. And Cloud. I gotta say, he's pushing the Cloud meta. I, I, I don't see a whole lot of Clouds really pushing the character like he does. Oh, absolutely not. This Sheiks is, I would say, a diamond in the rough oh, in yeah. the making. He came out of nowhere. Just came out and just started performing extremely well yeah. right off the bat. Just He would just play consistently, just play friendlies over at UNT so much. I remember playing him. I, yeah. was, I was there at Grand Finals with Sheiks whenever he first started. It's great to see him here now. And now we're going to see him up against Denti, a monster. Absolutely. Ooh, off stage, but he has a limit, which is a free recovery. Great cross slash. Ooh, up B. Clean stuff. I gotta say, he knows his range. He knows that cross slash is an incredible threat right above him. Once again, using it on the platforms. Once Another again. Up B, man. <laughs> he's, a, he's crazy, man. That up B is nuts. He's not afraid to really go in there and just dig it into your chest, you know? Oh, yeah. It's like drive it through just to send a message. You know what it reminds me of? In, like, Dragon Ball Super, whenever Trunks, like, stabs a moth suit. Oh, yeah, dude. It, that's what it looks like. Yeah, I gotta say, Cloud, it rocks that, you know, that uh, Trunks... That Trunks, that Trunks vibe, feel, yeah. you know? He's got the sword. He's got the hair. He's got the hair yeah. spiky hair. Just die blue, dude. But it's just straight up. <laughs> Ooh, but that forward air sending at a pretty disgusting angle, stalling out. Interesting? Okay. I feel it. I liked it. I like how he used the cross slash just to slow his momentum down and just avoid the flamethrower. Up throw. Most, Cloud is heavy. Most of the damage. 106%. Probably gonna win for a Ooh. down smash. The up smash gonna get the kill for Denti instead. Definitely a bad jump from uh, from Cheeks there. You know, Cloud wants to be in the air, throwing out those gigantic aerials. Denti knows this. Throwing out perfectly spaced forward tilt. These anti airs, but man, on the ground, Cloud also has some incredibly potent options. Absolutely. And in the air as well, too. Not as potent as they used to be, but still get the job done. You have fair, just if you land it on a character, you can get a lot of tools like cross slash or jab or down tilt even. So it's a good tool to like mix things up for Cloud. Yeah, and I gotta say, Cheeks knows his space. He's controlling it very well. You know, oh, when you, absolutely. When you see him miss a move, he's definitely trying to cover the space that Denti wants to threaten. Yes, indeed. Speaking of space. <laughs> Ivysaur yeah, covers his space. With that razor leaf, no doubt. Yeah, and then once once uh cheeks get in, you know, that, that up air and that back air, also incredible spacing tools. It's like a sword in say, itself. Also, don't even try to jump into Ivysaur because that up B gonna do so much meaty damage. Oh. Without That's shielding. a low shield, man. I know, such defense from Cheeks right now, just trying to stay alive. But that cross slash. Definitely oh. going to take a stock if he gets it, but it's running out of time. Oh, there we go. There we are. Great stuff. I believe that was going to run out any second there. Yeah, honestly, probably on the last second, too. Okay. Trying to look for some answers. But these percents. Ooh, we're going to see throw. some water gun going low. Great stuff. Getting out of that threatened zone. Yeah, just because of that wind box four Squirtle's water gun. <gasps> that was smart. What just getting switch, the switch out. Man. Yes. Once oh. again, using the Switch is the perfect possible time. Nintendo Switch. <laughs> I love it. I love it, Denti. That was, that, was, that, was that was good. I like that. I like that. Man, but now we got withdrawals Ooh, coming yeah. out. Here we go, that up B. Helping out Cheeks. Another back air. <gasps> Whoa! Oh! Not yet! His name is Jump. Using the stall, that's the sweetest switch right there. Ooh, looking for the fair. And getting back on stage. But Charizard's big. That cross slash, definitely gonna be a threat. Now back to Squirtle. He's about to run out of limit. Is he gonna use it? No. He's letting it run out. Great stall there from Denti, just letting limit take its course. I like how clouds are more willing to just let limit go now just try yeah, to let it go you don't have yeah. to use it if you're gonna put yourself in a bad spot why use it exactly that's he there we go great coverage great coverage from cheeks there now taking the first game against denti interesting you saw earlier when they played each other in winner's bracket mm -hmm. just their games just ended up being so close every time 
And you know, Cheeks, I'm not gonna lie, kinda robbed him out of that first game because of the SD, but solidly and assuredly just took this first game and losing bracket without question. Man, look at Source posting the, the money values in the chat. Ooh, we okay. see exactly how much these people make in here, you know? You know how much Austin is going Ooh, home with tonight. We got tonight. that crisp $100 bill for first Ooh. place with some extra change in that 40. Huh? Ooh, man. Change in your pocket so you can go get some food after, too. Oh, man. Oh, Whataburger sounds nice, bro. Ooh. But, man, there's a lot of nice things, including Whataburger and a Pokemon trainer and a cloud on screen right now. Definitely two people. For I am down for all of those things that you just Ooh, said. Definitely. Jumping in with the jab, okay. Yeah, Ooh. I gotta say, he's all in his head. He's all in his head right now. Denti trying to figure out an option to just even survive in this game, too. Bro, I'm speechless. Cheeks. That was a Cheeks play. Yeah, that was. That Cheeks was just a Cheeks ran play. over that, at, uh, or that uh, off stage overall. Man. It's nuts. <laughs> just I thinking know. about it, like it's just like I can't believe he got a kill like less than a minute in. Like that's insane. he has those high volume momentum plays that just just explode out of the gate. Just and at then he random. Runs. He's running with it now. Look at him playing right outside oh, yeah. Squirtle's range. Like he's not even trying to expose himself too much now. He's just picking the safe option. You know, I gotta say Squirtle into Cloud seems like a pretty good matchup. You know, able to pull him off stage. But look. He already switched him into Ivysaur. But I will say now, approaching Cloud in this game is still just as scary as it was. It really four. is. You know, the, the ticket to beating Cloud is definitely forcing him to use his retreating aerials. Make him yes. force him to the edge. Make Absolutely. him do a bad option. But right now, Cheeks is up a stock. He doesn't have to do any unsafe aerials, but that was an unsafe grab. Ooh, indeed. Gonna get punished for it with that up air. And now Cheeks trying to play out of disadvantage. Good downer from Denti though, but that fair again. Ooh. Almost got the switch, but what a air dodge from Cheeks. He caught the jump with the up smash. That was such a good reaction That's from Denti. That's the second bad jump that Denti has called out with an up smash. That's two. And I really hope we don't see three for three. May, depending on how frisky Cheeks is gonna get in this match. Looking for the jump right there. Ooh, but Charizard living that backer. No other Pokemon would have lived that. So Honestly. Okay. Charizard's so heavy right now. Ooh, but we're going to see. Only 9% off that, but it's going to keep growing. Denti not using the whole flamethrower, keeping it at its full charge. Okay. He Ooh, wants great. a really good option. Almost killing right there with the up B from Cloud. This is danger zone right here. Backer threading. Absolutely. He's trying to thread that needle as much as possible. Waiting for Denti to come in. The cross slash. Cross slash not taking it. 194. Oh, that was so close though. Ooh, but chasing him. Great stuff. That's how you punish Flare Blitz. You just follow him. Especially with the speed as high as Cloud. Oh yeah, absolutely. Just clean got that up tilt right there. Didn't Ooh. he have to get like an up smash or anything? Just no, he just down. needed an up tilt. That's all he needed. What if the up smash missed? Exactly. All right, and now Cheeks again with the lead, just content to just throw out those good aerials, like you said earlier. He threatens that space. He's not afraid to be slightly off stage to threaten the recovery of Pokemon Trainer. It could uh, be just to make his recovery safe. <gasps> Bad Razor Leaf. Oh, not the same. best punish, but still a punish. Spot dodge though. Oh, Cheeks. Winging that sword like butter. Oh, great roll. Ooh, what an F smash! That was such a good read on the neutral getup. Oh, Denti with the psychic level plays right oh. now. Oh, the roll in. Quite the, the unfortunate roll. The freaking roll in. Oh, that was quite unfortunate. But Denti's still in this. You couldn't even call that a habit because he wasn't even <laughs> rolling in. Sheiks was just like he, he just get he had to have guessed. But what if I just? But what if I just forward smash right now? I'm at zero. What if I just you can't do punish it? that. You can't. I'm, I'm, you cannot punish that. <laughs> I'm just gonna do it. Man. This is the high level play sometimes, I love to see, Sometimes, sometimes I just think like, what if Cheeks is just like, but what if I just smash? smash? <laughs> like, what are you gonna do, die? <laughs> Have you ever just hit a turtle? Like, you just beat a turtle to death? You know, one thing that I have not seen is a whole lot of withdrawal. From, uh, from that is Denti. true. That no. armor might be able to help out in a lot of situations. Yeah, and you know maybe some more, maybe some more creative play with with uh, Squirtle. 
You know, trying to get him off stage a little bit more, but that down air still oh. has his jump. Almost got another one. That forward smash That's be gonna be huge punish. Denti overextended in oh. the worst possible way there. And I know Denti can't be too happy about that. Definitely, but he's gonna he's gonna stay smart. He's gonna use his projectiles. Okay. And that forward now, is gonna be a good start. 85, definitely not out of the kill percent. Okay. Ooh, jump Ooh. up the platform. Cheeks running away, getting a little bit scared right there. But that cross slash doing a lot of damage. We're gonna see cross slash definitely put in a number here, but back throw. But back throw though. Down air, Nair, trying to go for a more unconventional punish there. Up B. Nair seemed like a solid option just because he used his jump and was trying to recover low in that situation. Definitely, and, and if he tried to jump, the multi-hits probably would have messed him up, but Cheeks, once again, going off stage, but Denti didn't punish it. 145, this is back throw percentage for... Absolutely. But now up throw. Limited. Wow, using the second hit just to make Ooh. the approach safe. What? Yeah, a down smash. Wow! Worth it. Worth it, absolutely. 146, that was definitely a throw. 100% worth it. Very least, just to take out that last stock and put Denti at a last stock situation. Ooh, trying to get the missed tech, but unfortunately, Cheeks not on the ground yet. Hold on, up air into forward air right there. Ooh, Denti is Ivysaur with the stage control. Oh, the fair though. Definitely, Denti tried to punish that uh, that up B. The uh, climb First hazard. Air? Oh, you're getting too cheeky. You were getting way too cheeky. That there. was a little too much. He yeah. raised the limit, and he was off stage in a bad position. But he's a stock up, and honestly. We saw zero percent last game. We saw no smash at this percent, and it killed. Yes. Now let's see what Denti is able to do because he does have a chance now. In He's order rolling. To back. He's rolling. He's scared. Yeah. Just a little bit flustered right now. Just trying to figure out his options. He needs to play the ledge smart. Use the razor lease. There and we now, go. Down throw. No nothing follow. off of it. And Not now sure rage. Even though he's still at that ledge, fighting his way back. Cheeks is content. Ooh. Just wait and let Denti get back on. Denti's gonna try and ride out the limit. Off stage. Possibly. But, and that tether's coming as strong. Still Ooh. has it. I knew it. He held it for the longest possible time and got it at the last instant where it mattered. Say, I have to say, I respect Denti for playing the ledge. I do. But his invincibility was out. And he really didn't have a whole lot of options there. I believe that he should have gone back on stage to get that invincibility and probably not push himself too far there. And you know it's crazy because if it, if it was just like one more second, Limit would have just ran out.